Tonight, we're going deep into bear country. Well, this looks like a good spot here. So we're gonna bring Rat with us. We need as many eyes on lookout as we can get. All right, guys, we really gotta be careful out here tonight. This is one of the most dangerous areas of the state. There's more damn wolves and bears here than, than anywhere else. Yeah, we gotta be on our toes. We just gotta watch each other's back. This Bigfoot we're after, he's got big ass feet. We really need to look out for big footprints. You know, we're talking 20 inches, maybe. Let's uh, keep our eyes open. Let's get her done. Let's go. Definitely lots of critters in here. Nothing on the thermal. to move around in here. Hell, I can't even get through here. This coverage is too thick. Hell, a moose can't come through there, and you won't even see it nothing but its head. Right. But if it's a thunderfoot, he's going to be sticking up higher. Yeah, but if it's a yogi or a boo-boo, he's going to be lower. That's right. We're going to run right up on him. And this is where they live. The thicker, the better. We're getting into spring break up now. What that means, all these bears are coming out of the den, and they're coming out hungry after being hibernated up all winter long. Look at that sucker. That's fresh busted off. Snapped right off. That could have been a bear rubbing that winter hide off of him. That could have been Thunderfoot rubbing his hide off, too. Whoa, listen to that. I'm moving right there. I'm gonna check the thermal. Watch out. See anything? I got something moving. There's something moving right over there. Oh, oh, oh. Something right there. There, right there in that bush. Oh, bears fighting, man. This place is crawling with bears. Yeah. I need to get the out of here. That was no bear. We just heard a loud ass roar. I have never heard anything like that. I can tell you one thing, that is no bear. That's Thunderfoot. Something moving away from us. Let's go up there and check it out. We're dealing with something so damn big and bad, it's scaring the damn bears off out of here. That damn thing's powerful. What do you got? Look at this ground. They tore this place up. Something had a heyday over here. Look at that sucker. Check this out. So what's your take on all this? Hell of a rumble going on here between two bears. We heard them fighting. That was when Thunderfoot heard the fight going on. Those bears, they didn't want to deal with that sucker. And they boogied out of here. This Thunderfoot we ran into tonight is big enough and powerful enough to run off two full-size grizzly bears. I need to get with Todd and come up with a design for a trap that's gonna contain this damn thing. All right, guys. Let's get out of that. Let's go. We're gonna go back into the area where we did our night investigation. Looks like something went through over here. This day investigation is gonna let us know if that Bigfoot's out there or it's a whole bunch of bears. Storage yard's right down there, where we heard the fight last night, it's right down that way. This road intersects right through the middle of it. He's either gonna be using it or he's gonna be crossing. So this is gonna be our best chance of finding some sort of sign. Let's uh, load up and head up the road and look for tracks. Let's find this big guy. Our goal today is to find any kind of evidence, tore up ground, tracks, trees broken down. Anything that's out of the ordinary. We're just following a moose trail here. 
That's definitely a moose there. Yeah, there's moose droppings right there. Yeah, I went ahead right up this trail. Up around that corner there. All right. Lead the way. Check this out. Damn, that thing's huge. Something big in there. Look at this. What the hell you think done that? I don't know. That thing's not rotten. How come we ain't seeing no animals? I don't know. It's quiet in here. This place is creeping me out. We need to be ready. Strange. I got a feeling that something is watching us. The hairs on the back of my neck are standing up. Something's out here. See nothing. Or it could be a bear just following us. We're not alone out here. It feels like we're getting close to something. Look at this hair. Looks like a big ass bedding area. Something dug that out. That's pretty fresh. Look at that tree right there. Oh, bark clawed off that. Damn. What is it? Look at the size of that bear crap. Whoa. Cover me. I'm going to start going down in there. I can't see down in there. I, I don't know. I can't see nothing. Be careful, Krusty. We can't see down in there. What do you got? Damn! This is a freaking den. There's parts of at least two moose down here. This, is, this was piled up definitely by a bear. That's what bears do. They bury their food and come back to it later. Something came in here and took it from the bear. Look at this. What do you got? Blood right there. He's bleeding good, whatever it is. He's dripping good. I think what happened here at this den, there was a hell of a tussle. They were fighting over a food source. There's two dead moose here. What my assumption is, it's Thunderfoot. He's coming through here cleaning house. I think what we're dealing with here Got a Bigfoot with a bad attitude. He run a bear out of here and wounded the damn thing. You know, we, we see now that he don't like nothing in his territory. Yeah. I think right now is a good time to retreat out of here and come up with a good plan for trapping this sucker. I'm yeah. with you. Let's mosey right back on out the way we can. Whatever this creature is, it's big, it's powerful, it's aggressive. It's almost like it's a damn bully. This is something that we haven't dealt with before. 